What's up guys? Welcome to your 27th Android tutorial. We're going to finish up our toggle button and check it out, make sure it works. In the last tutorial we set up this if else statement and basically it's going to check if our toggle is pressed for, or is, if it's on and then it's going to do whatever is in this statement. And if it's off, it's going to do whatever is within this statement. And it's going to go through this method every time the toggle button is touched or pressed because or clicked I should say. Um, because that's that's how this works because it, we set up an on click listener and every time it's clicked it's gonna go through this method and check for us now what we can do is we're gonna use the edit text uh, variable that we set up here um, and we have it referenced to our edit text in the XML and we're gonna change that so we called the edit text input so we're gonna say input and we can hit dot and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna set the input type and basically you know there's the password type in a text view or n number a number for the most part you can make make them only be able to put in numbers stuff like that so we're gonna say uh, the method set input type and as you can see it's a text view type for the most part and within the parameters I don't know if I want to show you that okay uh, let's copy and paste this and uh, this is going to be if it's false. So if it's off, we don't want to hide the password. So what we're going to do is we're going to refer to the input type class and say input type and then hit dot. And we have certain types of you know text that we can have within our, our as for our input type. And we're going to use the one called type class text. Now that's just going to be able I mean that's just going to be plain text that you can see nothing special about it. That's how you'd set up just uh you know your plain text. So if the toggle is off, it's going to be plain text. Now we need to kind of do the same method for if uh if the toggle is on. And it's going to be a little bit confusing. I mean this tutorial isn't so much about learning how to set the input type. Well kind of that's basically what this tutorial is. So I shouldn't say that's not what it's about. But you know, kn knowing all the fine details at this moment isn't that important. Um, it's like we, like I said, we're building kind of a reference application that you guys can go back and refer to when you guys are developing your own apps. So and learn learning the Android along the way, obviously. So how we're going to set the input type to be a password or the starred or basically uh, let's see if I have it pulled up. Yeah, see, like right now if we put Travis this is kind of setting the password as for uh, that's what's gonna look like it's gonna star out our text so that's what we're gonna set up if the toggle is set to true or if it's checked on and what we're gonna do is say input type dot uh, type class text again and you're like what well that we aren't done that's why I didn't want to set this one up first this is just saying we can put text, numbers, all that good stuff in there. And then we're going to put this line, like a line like that, that's not an L. Um, basically, that's the, I don't even know what that's called, actually. But it's the, the button right above your enter or right above your return key. And you have to hold shift to hit it. Um, so you put that line. And then you also put another input type or refer to the input type class and hit dot type. text and then um, variation and uh, variation password so that's gonna change it to um, basically back to the stars and I know that's kinda confusing why we had to put two different things in there don't worry about that but uh, yeah that's how we'd set that up and now again we're getting in there because we're using the edit text within uh, a subclass again so what we're gonna do is just change that edit text to be final and it should get should get rid of those errors now let's check our application, make sure it works. Um, again, we're just kind of getting familiar with Java. I'll leave this up for a second so you guys can pause it and make sure everything's spelled right within the brackets. But uh, yeah, we're just making sure, we're just walking through the Java process still and uh, making sure you guys are following along for the most part. But uh, yeah, kind of, a, kind of a lame tutorial, my bad. But uh, Hopefully you guys will like this application after we get done. It's going to explain a lot of Java and how we can reference stuff and use some certain methods with text. So here we go. We say Travis, and since it's toggled on, it's under stars. 
well actually um, since we define it in XML uh, we said Android colon password equals true it's going to be stars automatically and we also had this set to set to true as well when we started and then if we toggle off it says Travis and then we can toggle back on so you know kind of a lame tutorial but hopefully you learned something about the set type or input type and uh, set the input type alright I gotta go to bed but I will catch you guys later thanks again for watching and have a good day